Congress Berlin's regularly scheduled elections coming in the wake of Khrushchev's demand that the free city be neutralized turn into a plebiscite, testing the response to red threats toward this outpost of two and a half million far behind the Iron Curtain. Campaign rivalry is present, one reason for Chancellor Conrad Adenauer's flying visit. He represents a different party from that of Mayor Willy Brandt, but the text of Christian Democrat Adenauer's message is the same as the socialists. West Berlin will stand fast, and the Bonn Republic will back it to the hilt against Moscow's attempt to force the city under East German control. Forty-four-year-old Mayor Willy Brandt won re-election, his Social Democrats capturing nearly 54% of the vote, up 10% over 1954. Based on a massive turnout at the polls, it represents a solid endorsement of Brandt's staunchly anti-communist leadership. But the crucial figure was the communist ballot, only 2% of the electorate. Down a third from their previous vote, the Reds apparently failed to win even one of the 327 municipal offices. West Berlin, facing its gravest threat to survival in a decade, defies Soviet threats to cast its vote for freedom.